Wooski out there, but you don't want to tap in with Wu Wop. And he walked you through 63rd, bro. You still feel real tight with Wooski? Yeah, bro. Bro, a fuck with you on, bro. No, I I would like to do content with him, but I was just watching the Cam Capone interview with him. It, and it blew you high. Okay, okay. Let's talk it's about it. It's kind of hard to hear what he's saying. Okay, first of all, let's speak on that. But it's a lot better than the Truth Teller interview that he did with a mask on in a shitty-ass hotel room. Horrible audio. I couldn't hear a goddamn thing. <laughs> At least the Cam Capone one got a clear image and the fucking uh, the audio is good. But, yeah, I don't know. I feel like Cam Capone maybe did the Wooski interview that we were all looking for there. So that so that's what you was looking for. So that so you satisfied with that? At was, least the was audio good. was better. Truth teller, you've been doing this too long. The audio got to be better. Mm. That's just me. So you feel like Truth need to step it up? At least for the Wooski interview because he don't really talk too loud and he's talking through a shiesty. Okay, I do it different. But how often you talk to Wooski now? Um, shit. Last time I um topped it up with bro, shit, a couple weeks ago, shit. He was he was cool and no regular shit. I'm phoning up my motherfucker. You know, Wooski like how he is in his interviews. Um, ain't gonna over say too much. It just is what it is. I'm phoning up. Mm -hmm. You just gotta know what he talking about. It hit different. Do your homework. You gotta read between the lines. Do your homework on. It's a lot of reading between the lines with Wooski, bro. Right. Do it different. Yeah. It's not. It's not what Wooski say. Is what he didn't say, bro. Do your homework. Okay. You think he's all right, 